Hello friend, how are you? Uh, today in this video, I'll be teaching you how to enable Tenlet and also I will talk a bit more about ACL, how we block the Tenlet so let's get into the configuration so I have already assigned IP addresses and I have already conf uh, configured the RIP blocking protocol and you can see here yeah, everything is successful okay so So when I when I when now I try to do ten net ten net to this router uh, two dot one. This invalid command means we haven't uh, configured Tenlet yet. So let's configure Tenlet first. Mm, CLI. So you can see all the options here. BVTY. So zero to fifteen means the number of user you want to give access to your telnet. So for instance, uh, I will give only five users. Enter and login local. That. Uh, it's better to give the user name like okay Cisco one and password Cisco one two three and yeah mm, that's it now don't forget to enable password Cisco four one two three four so yeah that should be enough let's now try to do 10 to this router from this PC sorry still net 68.1.1 now here you, you can see that we can now our tenant is successful so username is Cisco one password Cisco one two three yeah you know you are now you get access to the router enable password is Cisco one two three four yeah now you can configure your router from the PC so, okay that's how tenlet works okay I uh, I'll show you from uh, the laptop as well. Terminate. Dot one dot four. Yeah, you're successful. Now uh, I will do a bit ACL in order to block Tenlet. So here, what I will do is. Mm, just give me a second. Sorry. So as you can see, so what I'll do is now I will block PC one. I'll block PC one. Tenlet and I allow 
left of one ten I mean that PC one won't be able to do the ten lead, but the uh, laptop one will be able to do the ten lead. So okay. So as you guys know about the ACL, or you guys are still confused about it, so I would suggest you to go to my last videos where I have talked more about ACL. So okay, uh, here I'll be using extended ACL. So as I said earlier, our destination will be this router, and our source is this one. So as I said, we always use um, extended ACL to the router which is nearest to the source. So this is the router. So we'll be applying ACL on this router. Okay. So let's go to CLI. Go and hit T. Let's hit extend one zero one. This will deny. Deny what? Deny TCP. So we'll deny this PC so the IP address of PC is 192.168.2.2 let me check let double check yeah 2.2 2. To, to host uh, we block this address to the destination our uh, router address uh, it's 192.168.1.1 so Kubalin, so we'll be blocking ten net. So ten net. Sorry, tell sorry, tell net. Yeah, that's it. Now it's just this one zero one permit TCP any any. That means everything else can access to the router. So yeah, so we'll use the key IP SS group one. So here I have I have used the inbound. So before we're able to do the telnet, let's see if this PC can do the telnet or now. Mm, okay, uh, it still still can do the download. Let's check this PC if it's able to. Sorry, now uh, connect one dot. Now you can see that uh, it's trying, but. Well, definitely yes. Now you can't do the template. That means we are successful to block PC one to the template, but we are able to the template through laptop one. Okay, that's that's it for today. Uh, I hope you guys are pretty much good with the ACL now. Uh, but if you still have some confusion, please do comment on my video. I uh, would love to help you guys and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.